So there was a question, interesting question on the community today about uh, updating field value from email request. Now this uh, question is about uh, possibility to complete the field value of a task generated from an email. In body email, I have the field value and I want to send this value to Jira issue. Now, this can be done using a script enough for Jira. So what you can do, you can basically write uh, a listener. And I made one video on uh, how to create a listener. So basically when you write a listener, let us say you can define here the name of uh, the listener. Let us say you want to update field from email body. So let the issues, when you receive emails, a new issue will be created. And whenever there is a new issue, you can basically listen for this event called issue created. Now, of course, you can limit this listener to a specific project if you want. Now, when you have a new issue created, then you can run this uh, script, of course, using a listener, where you can do a lot of wonderful things with the with, with the script here. So let us say you want to add a comment I made, I believe, uh, a video on this topic. Now, the good thing about this particular uh, part here is that when you receive a new issue, you can read the email body and you can define your logic. So let us say in your uh, email body, you have some keywords that you're looking for and whenever you receive those keywords or maybe you you have some pattern in the in the email body so that is up to you how you want to write the code so basically when you receive the code you can uh, when you receive the email and when you have a new issue created you can convert that of course you, you will let jira let jira convert that particular email in, into a new issue and when you have a new issue then this listener will basically read the body and uh, do some processing so using the REST API, you can update a field value based on, let us say those keywords that you may have in your uh, email. Now it can be a bit uh, tricky. So when, you, when it comes to looking for a specific keyword in the body, um, you need to basically define your logic in a way so that you can map those keywords to a specific field. For example, you may have uh, your uh, email body containing some keywords like urgent, not working, website is down, my printer is not working, so on. So basically you can build your vocabulary and uh, you can write a script to match those keywords. And of course, uh, it is then up to you how you want to define the logic. But to answer your question, yes, it is possible using uh, script enough for Jira, you can actually, because we, because we have the possibility of uh, writing our own script, our own Groovy script, and we can always update fields in Jira. Right now, if you want, uh, let us say, to add a comment, you can take a look at this example. But uh, since we are talking about REST API, you can always go to the Jira's uh, cloud REST API documentation. I have made plenty of videos on different things that you can do with the REST API. And if you look at those examples, you'll find uh, examples where I'm updating a field or a custom field and you can basically use that particular endpoint. So whenever you're working with Script Enough for Jira, it is all about knowing the correct endpoint that you need to use. And uh, if you're updating something, you can definitely do that. So this is all I wanted to share in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.